believe how busy our day was, but more importantly to me, this was really, really an amazing day and that we, how we're able to really improve the lives of so many people who have chronic inflammation and pain. And as you and I have always focused on when people age, the cellular aging process is really about what happens with inflammation and which turns into pain. And we've been able to today do things that are completely unavailable in virtually every other country and really make a major impact in people's lives as far as how they feel, but more importantly, how their own body cells can regenerate conditions that in contemporary medicine, they feel that we can't really do anything about. So this is really the medicine in the future and it's super exciting. And the applications to me, like just completely opened my mind to so many other things we can do. No, I agree completely, you know, and it's a big difference uh, compared to traditional medicine. We're opening here a window to treat inflammation biologically, not only pharmacologically, like it's been done in the past, you know, and up until t today, you know. Now in Costa Rica, we have the possibility and all the legal framework to be able to treat people with uh, stem cell treatments. And most importantly, like the patients we did today, treat the uh, injury at the site, guided with ultrasound guidance, you know, so we are exactly putting those cells, you know, where they have to be and uh, getting the awesome results that we're getting. Well, you know, I'm so excited because we've already seen a virtually miraculous improvements in people with MS. It, and our other patients who have been told, physicians have been told they need a knee replacement or a hip replacement and, and are now virtually completely normal after even a, a month or two. So this really makes me think, why isn't the rest of the world really looking at the potential of our own cells to heal? I guess it's just um, a closed mind to what the model of medicine has been in the past, but I think what we're really trying to say, hey, we need a new model of medicine. No, of course we need a new model of medicine. And what we're doing is actually so basic. We are using your own cells, you know, to treat the major cause of a disease, which is inflammation. Every virtual disease, you know, that human beings can have has a common start point, inflammation. Inflammation of the endothelium, of your cartilage tissues, of your muscles, you know, everything starts with inflammation. And if we're able to control with stem cell treatments, inflammation, we're treating the root and the origin of disease. Well, I agree. But the other exciting area is that the applications we're using now for cosmetic procedures, which used to be much more involved with surgery, but now just transplanting fat cells with growth factors, with new types of products of stem cells, that's opening up another whole window for cosmetic procedures with an extremely natural result. And that's another whole field I think is going to change dramatically in the next few years. Oh yeah, of course. Um, the results that we have gotten with uh, stem cell facelifts are very nice, you know, the skin improves so much. And I think these added to the minimal invasive procedures that we have done for years for facial surgery uh, is exactly what we needed to get that result, those results to, you know, a next level. Well, all I can say is I, I couldn't be happier today. It's so rewarding to like make a difference. But in the meantime, we have one more patient to do. So let's go do it, man. Yeah.